good morning children i am very happy to announce here that my videos from lesson 1 to 12 are very much liked by you and the comments uh, which you have given me gives a, a boost in uh, my thinking that i can do much better and for in this regards this video is also uh, of the lesson number 13 in which i am taking only the targeted learning outcomes which are prescribed by our ncert and back to basic project of kendri vidyalaya sangathan in which the uh, each and every lesson has a uh, some target set by the institute and which we can learn by reading by learning or by doing some activities related to the lessons given in our textbooks now let's start our video but before starting this once again i am requesting you to like subscribe and share my videos to your friends so that it can grow up now let's come to the next slide of this chapter the first target learning outcome of chapter number 13 is to locate the states on map of india which traveler that is the gorav jani passed from mumbai to leh okay he started journey from mumbai from gujarat rajasthan then delhi then himachal pradesh then ladakh again in the jammu and kashmir and then he came back to mumbai while going from uh, this uh, mumbai to ladakh he passed so many states like maharashtra whose capital is mumbai gujarat whose capital is gandhinagar rajasthan whose capital is jaipur himachal pradesh shimla jammu and kashmir has two capitals shrinagar in summers jammu in winters ladakh is a union territory uh, which whose capital is leh okay here the kashmir is written wrong now the second tlo of this lesson is to know the different kinds of shelters means houses according to the physical environment kinds of houses like shelter as per the physical conditions availability of materials like wood stone bamboo or whatever in the physical conditions of that place like in assam this the figure shows that the houses are made up of bamboos because in assam bamboos grow in very large quantity so they use them and here the flooded area is there so they make their houses on the bamboo poles in le as you have read in the chapter the houses are of two stories made up of stones like in shrinagar the houses boat houses are very much famous and in metro cities you can uh, see the large skyscrapers multi story buildings which is made up of cement and in the village this the houses are made up of mud and the straw uh, roofs and in in the similar way the gorav jani started his journey as from mumbai where multi story buildings are common in which the flats are made of cement bricks steel glass etc such type of shelters he found in delhi also after that he reached manali from their le where he saw houses made up of stones whose walls are covered with mud and lime mixture so they looks white in color during his journey he himself stayed in a tent a kind of shelter so he also and he also find rabu a kind of another kind of a tent made up of strips of yak here in which jangpas tribe usually lives on high altitudes in jammu he find donga shikara a boat house as a shelter form but in jammu again he saw the same kinds of houses as in the mumbai means the house is made up of cement stone steel etc so this is the second tlo of the chapter means the what are the different kinds of uh, shelters as per the 
physical environment or the physical conditions of a place. Now in the third year of our chapter is to know about the cold desert that is Leh. Now just first of all you observe these two pictures. This is also a desert and it is also a desert but generally you are familiar with this because you know that the house uh, the desert has lot of sand camel is the main animal of uh, desert known as the ship of the desert also but children there are two kinds of deserts means the cold desert as well as the hot desert both deserts are different like it is uh, hot it is hot and this one is the and this is the wind uh, cold desert okay what is the difference that uh, the both have the low uh, have very low rainfall and less vegetation vegetation means the growing of plants the both one is rocky and the other one is sandy the difference is only only that cold desert is rocky while the hot desert is sandy so children these are the three targeted learning outcomes which we must learn while reading or while learning this chapter number 13 a uh, shelter so high for the complete explanation you just watch my part 2 video in which i will explain the whole lesson in simple and easy language and along with that i can uh, we i am going to take the questions also which are given in the lesson till then goodbye once again, subscribe, like and share my videos. Thank you so much for watching it.